I'll be unboxing the Heron Standard version of New Jeans' new album, How Sweet. So there should be an additional postcard. And there will be a music CD. So when you open it up, every version has this cardboard covering. And let's take a look at the inclusions. Actually, one postcard is the Target exclusive version, and I believe it's this one. This one is a US exclusive, maybe a Europe exclusive too. We got three postcards. Here's our photo card sleeve jacket. A look at the messages. First photo card. She always gives off like a princess vibe. Well, technically, I'm showing these backwards. But I like showing the back side of photo cards first. Similar selfie to that photo over there. Similar outfits there. In this photo card set of vibe. That's a photo card set. Here's her Powerpuff Girl character. Which still shows up in this album, but if you look at um, the previews, you'll see that their upcoming album, Supernatural, will have Takashi Murakami's art style of each of the members. So I'm very curious to see that in the packaging for that, their upcoming album. I think I showed that already. Here's her sticker set. It's stapled, so you gotta be careful when you open that up. One circular member sticker. Team logo stickers. Toki character. And a sticker that says, how sweet. I think this is called the interview book. Officially, it's called the interview book, but it's also a photo book. See, like the graffiti style and tagging style within this jacket. So pretty. I really like head in space. Like, I know everybody, every fan always mentions how she has such a cat-like face. But seriously, so unique and interesting to look at. So, hope to see more of Hedden in future comebacks. And I really hope that New Jeans will perform in LA again someday. So whatever happens, just hoping that you know they could keep their streak going strong because I just love them so much. And heading my bias record is slowly becoming my bias, but I still feel like Minji's my main bias. But I I don't know, maybe Minji and Hedden are equal in my bias list, I guess. I just really like them both. More of that graffiti tagging style throughout the jacket. And everyone just so stylish with their 90s hip hop looks. I really like the choreo for How Sweet. Bubblegum, I watched the choreo like once, so I'll have to check it out again. 
but yeah definitely like these songs many familiar writers and producers were involved with these songs one of them being 250 oh my gosh she's so pretty look at this mini poster she just really has like a princess vibe to her doesn't she and this is like a large photo book that opens like vertically so I'm gonna have to zoom out and just flip through it okay so this is what I'm talking about it's a vertical photo book I'm gonna start flipping through hopefully you can see everything there might be a slight glare I'll try my best to show it all because there's like quite a bit of pages for this photo book but let me tell you guys getting the head in version or just getting any version off the shelves of Target or even ordering online is so crazy because Target does not separate the album types by different DPCIs. So let's say you order it online and pick it up from the store. You could get duplicates and you could get random album versions. Then when you ask for a certain version, you already know it's not like the employees at Target are going to know the difference unless you show a photo or like go all the way to the back at electronics and have one of the workers, you know, get the version that you do want. And then most of the time, at least in my case, they say, oh, it's on the shelf. Then I have to be like, no, they're all like the same version. I want this version. So I actually went to Target for like the second time and I had to exchange some duplicates I had and have the worker in Target go to the back and then specify, hey, I want this one and this one if you have it in the back. But it's like not always guaranteed. It's really hard getting all the versions you want, especially if there's like specific member digipack versions and they don't just lay it all out on the shelf or it sells out quickly. So if you're having any problems trying to get your copy in Target, I would recommend um, just going straight to the electronics section find a worker and hopefully they'll be kind enough to try to get you the version you want but I've had experiences with other albums that had like different member digipack versions where there's like so many members that it's hard for them to remember which one you were requesting so I've had experiences when the poor target worker had to like bring a whole big box full of albums and I had to just like pick it out myself it could get hectic sometimes so I was just like so glad that the worker was able to find me the remaining versions that I needed that they had in stock and I actually really wanted Hedden's the most like if I couldn't get anyone's version I would at least want Hedden or Minji's but luckily I'll be able to unbox probably maybe all versions eventually but um of course you always want to get the main members that you collect and that actually happens to be Hedin and Minji. Yeah. And seriously, look at her styling. Look at her face. She's just so pretty. So photogenic. And she's actually such a joy to watch performing. Her and Hani are just like really eye-catching to me in terms of choreography. But seriously, all the members have such amazing charms, so I'm just hoping for the best for this group and hope we could get more, um, more bops from them. I'm really loving the styling on Hedden. side and that was the photo book and that was my unboxing of the target exclusive head in standard version